So guys, what I want to do today is dive into the official announcement from Atlassian and Slack. I want to dive into how HipChat and Stride are being purchased by Slack it to be embedded in their team communication software. Now, as you many of you guys know, uh, Atlassian is a massive company and Slack is also a big company and growing. And this is a massive move in the space. So I want to dive into the partnership. I want to dive into where I think this is going for Slack and hopefully it will give you a nice outline of everything. So as you can imagine, Atlassian is quite a big company now. They own a host of different resources, Jira, many products inside Jira, Status, Page, Confluence, Trello, which many of you guys know, Bitbucket, Sourcetree, Bamboo, Fisheye, Crucible, and Crowd, mainly used by developers, uh, and they have a whole host of resources. Now, one of their products, HipChat, which was created in 2010, seven years later in September 2017, it was partly replaced by Stride. Now, Stride is uh, Alassian's attempt at a team communication tool, allowing teams to chat and communicate across the day. Now, as sort of Slack has been progressing, they've been dominating the market. Um, obviously, there are plenty of other alternatives out there, like the likes of Twist, uh, and Stride was one of them. And they were always uh, sort of trying to battle in friendly competition with Slack, even sometimes posting on social media nice friendly birthday updates um, and also sort of teasing each other about cake and cookies on social media, which is amazing. Now, as you can imagine, uh, Alassian sort of have been thinking over a long period of time. A year is a good period of time to uh, sort of been looking at that, uh, how, it, how well Slight Stride's going. And as you can imagine, they made a decision and Slack decided to purchase the likes of uh, HipChat and Stride. Now, how does that exactly work? So Atlassian has made an equity investment in Slack and Slack has acquired the IP for Stride and HipChat Cloud, uh, which sadly both will be discontinued. Now, you're probably wondering when that will actually happen. Now, they have mentioned that the discontinue uh, discontinuement of Stride and HipChat will be on February 15th of 2019. Now, it's weirdly the day after Valentine's Day. Maybe that's uh, so that you can break up um, after Valentine's Day. So as you can imagine, they've made uh, all the statements they have, uh, Alassian saying this is the most strategic move forward, and also uh, stating that they'll be deepening the integrations between Slack, Jira Cloud, Bitbucket Cloud, and also Trello, and a few more creations of new integrations inside of that products. Now, they're not abandoning their original vision of the product, mainly just uh, seeing that the partnership will blend in with the mission that Slack is working on. So guys, as you can imagine, this is a huge deal for both companies. And my personal opinion is that Slack will be taking its popularity and combining it with two elements. Now Stride, for many people who don't know, has a gorgeous UI. Now I think the UI of Stride just looks great and works phenomenally. Now I can see uh, that they'll sort of blend those two experiences together. I can see that a lot of people are getting a bit bored with the Slack UI. Uh, Slack UI is good, but it just doesn't do anything above the board. It looks fairly regular, hasn't changed for quite a while now. And I think Stride will add that beauty in there. I think HipChat will provide a lot of sort of stability functions and a way for them to just continue progressively growing. I do definitely see Slack growing in the future. I remember the first time that I started using Slack, it was back in 2013. I remember onboarding uh, the team that I worked with at the time on it, um, and I never saw it round about. Uh, now, every time I walk in a coffee shop, I end up finding someone who is using Slack, which is pretty amazing in the space of like four or five years, uh, especially to have grown so rapidly. So I can imagine Stride will be integrated inside of Slack's UI, but we'll definitely be seeing in the future. It's something that we have to keep our eyes open for and definitely see whether Slack will be working on that side of stuff. Anyway guys, hopefully you enjoyed this short update. Hopefully it gave you enough insight into this update. Um, just a little announcement from me, on the August 1st, I'll be releasing Tools They Use podcast, uh, which is series three. So you guys can join in and you can sign up on iTunes below uh, to get ready for that launch on August 1st. Anyway guys, a huge, huge thank you for stopping by today. Make sure to pop in the comments, whether you're a Stride user, HipChat user, it'd be great to hear your opinions on this latest announcement. Anyway guys, make sure to have a great week, keep productive, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Cheers.